Hello everybody, it's your boy No Remorse and today I got some more PUBG gameplay for you guys. Alright guys, let's get into this video. So here we decided to land on Georgia Pole. Now usually I land here whenever I have teammates with me. If I'm playing solo, I don't come here. There's too many players to deal with. But if you have a whole team with you, you guys can pretty much land here. Now for some reason, my teammates did not want to land here with me. They wanted to land somewhere else, which was fine. Uh, I didn't see a lot of players land on this part of the map so I decided to start looting now this is the run that I always do when I come in here I hit these warehouses first get in and get out I don't like doing any of the uh, houses or the apartments there's too many doors to open there's too many stairs to climb up this you just get in get out get your stuff and you're ready to rock so once I get everything that I need I keep on moving moving towards the circle now my teammates were on the other side of the map which is fine so here I just like to get in, get out, get my stuff, and move on to the middle of the circle. I know a lot of players like to go through the apartments, go through every house, every door, every bathroom. That takes forever, and most of the time you don't get a lot of loot. But here in Georgia Pole, once you land here and you hit these warehouses, uh, you pretty much are, are going to come out with a lot of loot, as you can see right now. Now the bad part about playing with randoms... Uh, 99% of the time they're not using their microphones and that's what happened with me uh, in this gameplay as you can see um, my teammates weren't using their mics uh, which is fine I mean I'm already used to it a lot of them don't want to use their mics I don't know why uh, it's just what it is so here I decided to loot my own stuff and make my way towards where they were at so we got a level 2 helmet level 3 backpack no weapon yet there's no uh, enemies around me so I can pretty much just pick whatever I want as you can see right here I don't have nothing to worry about for the moment I'm outside the circle hit the top of these crates now hitting the top of these crates also takes a little bit of time and if you miss jump these crates you're gonna fall down and you have to go all the way around and climb back up here here I got me a car 98 awesome weapon if you can find a silencer for it if not the whole lobby will hear you once you start blasting away start taking enemies out you're gonna have to move because people are gonna pinpoint wherever you're at with this weapon this weapon is so loud half of the lobby will hear you so here make sure you time your jumps correctly Got my Red Bull right there, a little energy drink. Anything else I can loot? A couple of meds and keep on moving. Now after I hit these uh, warehouses, if I have pretty much, if the circle is on me, I'll loot more time here. But since the circle is already moving, uh, I'm gonna have to uh, make my way towards the center of the circle so I'll start hitting from the side of this mountain here hit these houses here I always do this run always and I always come out with a lot of loot hit everything here sometimes there's ammo in here then you move on and hit these houses over here and make sure you guys have a good headset and you're set uh, that way you can hear players around you gunshots around you now I like to always keep moving side to side for some reason I wasn't paying attention I was doing something else I don't know what's going on but uh, as you can see I'm running in a straight line and if there's a player behind me they're gonna have an easy shot at me so make sure you always whenever you're running in the middle of a field you're always zigzagging up and down jumping up and down and everything and here my controllers are dying out for me so I'm about to change batteries real quick a couple more meds Okay, there I changed my batteries. Now we're back. Now here I have a vehicle. So I'm set. So all I have to do is just finish looting these houses and keep on moving. So I pretty much got a couple of meds, a couple of energy drinks, got me a car, a couple of bandages. So you're pretty much set. Now all I need is uh, either an SMG. An assault rifle in here 
SMG, pick that up. Use that as my secondary for close quarter combat inside these houses. Make sure I pick up everything I need before I have to move. Now there's that eight times. I don't need it. Uh, I'm pretty much good with either a two times or a four times scope on the car. Anything else, uh, it's pretty hard to aim at close distance. It's good for long distance, but uh, usually I like to get pretty close to the enemy. So um, two times and four times scope is pretty much okay for me. So once you grab everything off this roof, you're ready to go. Grab my motorcycle and make my way towards uh, the center of the circle. It's uh, over there by the military base. So here we made it to the edge of the ocean. Now I decided to make uh, my way towards the edge of the beach right here because uh, there's players on the bridge and usually they're picking people off. So I decided to uh, do the old Michael Phelps way and just swim for it. Now that we made it over here, I caught up to my teammates and we're making our way towards uh, the military base. Now we're down to 41 players. You can hear gunshots everywhere. I hate playing here. There's so many campers, so many snipers on top of these roofs. Like right here I'm running in the middle of nowhere and I can just get sniped if I'm not paying attention. That's something you gotta worry about. So I wasn't able to get anything high powered except my car 98 and this UM, uh, UMP. I got my teammates going through these apartments. I don't like going through these apartments. There's so many corners you have to check as you're going in and out of these rooms. Now here I decided to take the roof, but like I said, there could be a sniper looking at me and just waiting for me to stop so he can take a shot at me and take me out. So I don't recommend uh, coming up on these roofs uh, towards uh, late game uh, because somebody's already set up somewhere and they're just waiting for players to come on to the side of this circle and ready to take you out. Make sure you close the door behind you. That way somebody's sneaking up on you. Now you can hear all these footsteps around me, but it's my teammates. And that's the only bad part about going through these apartments is whenever you're going through the other apartments with the two or three stories above you, you can't tell wherever they're at and you know they're up above you but it's kind of hard to pinpoint them so that's why I don't like going through these apartments I just like getting in and getting out get my stuff and let's go there's a lot of players that like looting and they spend half of the time looting and by the end of the game they die and all they did was loot I'd rather get my stuff and get to the center of the circle as soon as possible and start taking people out but in this gameplay, I'm going to have to let my teammates do all the work. We already lost one teammate. So it's just us three. I'm going to move across here to this open area. Make sure you use these bushes for cover. You can hide in these. Uh, actually, you can't use them for cover. You can just use them to hide in. As long as nobody's seen you hiding them, nobody should be able to pinpoint you and take a shot at you. I'm looking at windows, roofs, everywhere, side of the hill to see if I see any movement. I mean I hear the gunshots, they're pretty far away but still there could be somebody just sitting here and camping. You never know. Now my teammates weren't using their mics. I think they were in a party which is fine. So I'm trying to use them uh, to see wherever they're looking at so I can help them out because uh, they weren't using their mic, so the only way I, the only thing I can do is just use them for uh, communication and see wherever they're at. They help me out, help them out, shoot people. Now, right here, there gonna be players anywhere. I hate walking through these areas. It's just so open. Here, I'm just looking for extra loot ammo so here we're getting down to 32 players so I decided to boost 
because we're going to get into some gunfights pretty soon. The circles are getting pretty small. And there's a lot of players still left. So I'd rather be safe. You just never know where there's anybody at. You just got to use the headset to hear footsteps or gunshots. You can see we're dead center. Use these bushes. I'm looking at the hills. Anybody behind me? Nothing. So I gotta start moving towards my teammates. Here are the circle shrinking on us. You can see we're dead center. You can just hear gunshots everywhere. Here I'm just waiting for the circle to shrink to see where I have to move for the next circle. And as you can see I'm right at the edge of the circle which is fine. That means I'm going to have enemies coming in from behind me if they're um, in front of the blue zone. My teammates start moving, so I decided to go with them. Better cross my fingers, nobody's coming in behind me and shooting me. That was a new bad thing. Start using these fences for cover. Look at this wide open area. Anybody can just already be scoping this out. I'm just waiting for us to stop so they can take a clean shot at us. So make sure you use these barrels. Crouch. Keep moving. Don't stop. I'm trying to look over there by the airplanes. Nothing. There's pretty much nowhere to hide here. Looking for these hills up here. Here comes my teammate. All I hear is his footsteps. And here's when it's, where it's going to start getting messy for us. We hear cars, gunshots. We're down to our last 27. All I'm doing is trying to use my headset, listening, listening. Try not to stand in one spot too long. Trying to use the wall and this building next to me for cover. So I'll have to just worry about two areas, either front or back. Now as you can see my teammates looking up there on the hill, so I'm going to have to use that. He sees something. I hear something too. So what's he looking at? He's aiming at the top of the hill. So they decided to move. So I'm use this corner right here and these bushes for cover. We got an airdrop coming in. And my teammates picked it up. using this bush for cover as long as you don't move you should be okay if I had a silencer on my car I'd be more deadlier but once I start firing this thing away everybody's gonna know where I'm at so I gotta make my shots count
start taking shots. My turn. Hit him. Hit him once. My settings are still a little off. See a player right here. Once he pokes his head out, I'm gonna start taking him out. There he is. Taking shots. Let my teammates do all the work. Since I don't have a high powered rifle right now, I'm gonna have to pick my shots carefully. Trying not to give my position away. I'm gonna try to reload, I got one bullet in the chamber. Where's that other player at? Easy. Headshot taken down. Now he's gonna die later on because he hides in there. His teammates don't revive him, so I'm gonna get the kill later. I got two players rushing us over here. He hasn't seen me. I see him and his teammate. If I shoot through the fence, I'll probably hit the fence, so I decided to start taking shots at his buddy. Now these leaves got in my way. Missed. Circle. There I got the kill from the guy that I knocked down behind me. Gotta push this real quick. This circle really hurts. It starts taking your health down pretty fast. Make sure I use my meds. Heal up real quick. We're down to 12. One of our teammates goes down. I start taking shots over here. I don't know where they're coming from. Make sure you use everything else I have over here. My boost, my medicine, everything. And I'm out. So I have bandages and meds. So I guess he's gonna revive our teammate. Anybody coming from this area over here from the airplanes? They're gonna die because they have no cover. We have all the cover in the world over here. We start taking shots. I don't know from where. Not from behind us because we're on the edge of the circle. And they're, they're, there they are right there in front of us. Put down to nine. Circle's moving. Start taking a little bit of damage. He just barely moved. Now they're in the blue zone. They're taking damage. Knock him out. I take some damage. Start healing up. laying in the grass over there and that was it well, i hope you guys liked the video this is no remorse and i'm signing out